Hello everybody and welcome to Puck Review with Peter Pucker, episode 420, a channel over sample. As the name suggests, this episode is a special episode. And because of that, I will be showing you a very special, super hard hitting, most professional, insanely quality sample pack. This sample pack is something I've been secretly using and very much loving for the past months. I got this privilege to be able to use it before its premiere and it helped me to make much better tracks and it saved me so much time. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome The Ultimate Future Bass Toolkit 1500 sounds, midis, acapellas A magnificent legendary pack by Oversample Oversample? By Oversample? Hold on a second, so all that time I was talking about my own sample bar? Huh? Interesting and very insane. Am I having Alzheimer? Or is this pack actually that good? Ladies and gentlemen, so in today's video I will be presenting you my latest sample pack, a future-based sample pack. What I said was 100% true that I'm really excited about this pack and I really like this pack and I use it all the time. So today we're gonna do a showcase of this pack, I'm gonna show you what's inside, maybe we're gonna make a little truck. If you're interested and if you're looking for a future-based sample pack or something that is just like sick, you don't have to go to hospital to pick up sick old people, you can pick this sick sample pack. A lot of people are saying really good things about it, which I'm really happy about because I wanted to like, you know, put everything that a future based producer needs into a sample pack, equip them with whatever they need to make sick tracks. And I, I do believe this is this is it. Let me show you what's inside. So when you download the sample pack, the packed version is smaller, obviously, but the whole thing is like four gigabytes. So that is a lot of content. And there's like 1500 samples. Crazy. When you download this, when you unpack the thing, you'll see this folder. So there's stuff like drums, obviously, drum loops, build up drums, shakers, top loops, drum one shots, any, any kind, fills, effects, ambiences to put in a background, fallers for some transitions transition, impacts, risers as well, sweep ups and transitions which go up and down, melodic content, chord stacks because everyone loves chord stacks, guitar loops because everyone likes guitar loops, melody loops, lots of them, a hundred melody loops, insane? I am, maybe, yeah, that's a lot, a lot of pads and a lot of piano loops, hundred midi files in case you want to like base your song on a midi, have full control of the sounds, playable one shots, they're really cool, 808s, bass one shots, brasses, synths and and then we got vocals, acapellas, loops, and one shots. I will go uh, over uh, e everything in a second, but like acapellas, I've collabed with some um, really cool producers. Like um, I'm gonna fuck this name up. I'm Alrit. I'm Alrit. Oh, all right. I worked with this guy. I, I will work with a, with a girl also, and we made three acapellas, and they're super quality. You can hear one of them uh, on the preview track. Oh, actually, two of them on the preview track, and there's uh, there's another one. So let me start with drums. They're super punchy, they're super vibey, check this out. So we have build-up loops, for example. There's lots of trappy sounds and also lots of cinematic orchestral sounds. So if you're into making epic future bass, you can find a lot of stuff in here that will be useful. Oh, hell yeah. So full loops. Um, this is one of my favorites here. Oof, kind of like a flumon, right? Lots of vibey ones, shaker loops Like these Like classic shaker loops, top loops Drum one shots from, you know, claps Crashes, hi-hats open hi-hats, kicks, shit like that, perks, rides, snares, super sick fills, ambiences, I really, I really like putting rain in a song, it's really cool, vocals, 
follow. Simple followers and impacts. Risers, sweep ups. If you want transitions, it, it's just it's just so useful. I really like these ones. Right, and then we are get, going into the melodic content. Uh, obviously, chord stacks. Super big guitar loops. Melody loops. <laughs> melody loops, we went crazy on this because there's 100 melody loops. You can take them, you can uh, use them as, as they are, or use, you can just flip them. There's also like future bassy ones, there's also lots of poppy melodies because I wanted to not not only go for epic future bass vibe but I also wanted to go for like a poppy one, for like a, like a mainstream EDM, so you can find that also here. Kind of drool, right? Pads! Ooh. Good stuff. Uh, piano loops. Nothing really, you know, just the piano chord progressions. They're really great to start a track with. So midis, uh, if you wanna, you know, just grab a midi, put the sound onto it, and just have a lot of control. So playable one shots, uh, obviously some 808s. Oh, really clean one. One is 50 bass one shots. Like that, different than 808s. There are also like respaces, you can just put them into uh, a sampler and use as a respace. Process, simple thing. A synth one shots. So if you're not using a synthesizer, you can use these. You can just put them into a sampler and you can just play them. Check this out. That's that. So vocals, uh, acapellas, right? Falling and I never away your name. Oh, burns it back. So we got this. I think I put, I think this isn't the up to date version, right? Is it? Is it the newest? Am I browsing the newest? Uh, anyways, you have this. Some, you know, some uh, acapellas and shit. What we went for is we did full track acapella. So you just put a acapella into your song and it covers the intro, verse, build up uh, chorus and basically the whole thing. There are two verses per acapella. Uh, there's a main vocal, there's, uh, there are harmonies, there are ad-libs. There's basically a full vocal for a full track. Vocal loops, which is vocal chops. shots so let's just maybe make a make a little truck with just with just sample so you get this and then let's say we need like a top loop right Okay, uh, so that as a, as, a, as a main part, then uh, on the second part, we can just simply put a fill. 
So then we're gonna take a look at the, the name because on each name there's not only the BPM but also a scale of each sound. So G major, we're gonna look for some G major or actually anything in major because we can pitch it. As you can hear, this is a uh, chord stock, so it doesn't have a bass line. It has a really low note, but it's not bass line. So we can go into playable one shots. We can take a bass one shot. Yeah, this one sounds good. So this is F. So then we need to put an alpha on this. So I'm just gonna simply alpha tool on that. To match the shape of the, the chord stacks. Leave that here. So that's it for this video. If you enjoyed what you saw, make sure to check out the link in the description and get your own copy. If you do so, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope the pack is really helpful. I hope it makes your sound songs much better. So have a nice day and I'll see you in the next one. And because of that, I will be showing you a very special, super hard hitting, meh. <laughs> and because of that, <clears throat> as the name suggests, this episode is a very special episode. It's a special episode. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs>